I didn't become plastic surgeon to the richest woman in L.A. to be stuck on an assembly line of middle-aged tits and ass. You're supposed to hook me up. Give me the keys to the kingdom. <sighs> what an idiot. Jesus, if any celebrity gives a shit about where the first wives club get their faces done, you and your pack will have to find somebody else to be at your beck and call. I completely understand. There's certainly nothing glamorous about an assembly line of middle-aged tits and ass. What you need is a surgery that will set you apart, give you the attention you deserve as a doctor and as an artist. That's a good start. I've had a chance to watch you work, Dr. Troy, and I've seen the results. You're really no different than a sculptor, chiseling away at the human form, manipulating tissue and bone. Please, don't ever denigrate yourself. You're not just a plastic surgeon. You're a modern-day Michelangelo. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. Rodin, maybe. I'm glad that you understand. Of course I do. That's why I saved myself for last. I am the canvas upon which you can truly express yourself. And how exactly would you like to be expressed? I want my face to reflect the duality of my nature, my sensuous animal spirit, the sacred feline essence within. You want a softer, more sensual look. Did you know that the Egyptians believed that the cat was endowed with the light of human consciousness? They believed that the souls who had died entered into the cat, giving it its powerful radiance. I want you to bring me closer to that radiance. You want me to make you look like a cat? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I'm not insane. <laughs> That's a relief. Whiskers and tails are really not my specialty. Well, maybe I was wrong about you. I thought as an artist, you might be able to find a way to accentuate my more feline characteristics, to suggest its form within mine. Why on earth do you want this done? If I can no longer be young, I want my face to reflect all the wisdom and power in me. We're extraordinary people, living ordinary lives, you and I, because no one sees us, no one really knows who we are. You're an artist, not a mechanic. I'm offering you a chance to prove it. <laughs>